Like, uh, you know, we've talked about that a lot. Um, we'll see where we go forward. I think, obviously, uh, you guys could read between the lines. Patrick Tolles did some very good things a year ago, has the experience. He probably has a leg up right now. Um, but we'll see as we move forward. Uh, we're certainly going to leave that open to compete uh, throughout the summer and throughout fall camp. Has Reese been cleared to do anything extra? Or to the no. Where is, are you? No. Uh, he's. he's that's good. That's a significant injury, uh, as you know. He's limping and, and uh, slow uh, to move right now, but uh, we expect he'll be ready probably mid-August. Mark, what was the thought process in the home and home series or something? Well, we were, we were stuck in a bad position with the with UAB dropping football, so uh, it was difficult to find a game at that point in time for for the for that particular date. So, uh, you know, we got in conversations with them and it worked out. So uh, that, that'll be good for us. Mark, how much do you think of being on opening day today versus last year? Pardon me? How much better do you think of the program will be team-wise from the open kickoff this year versus the open kickoff last year? Uh, significant. Uh, we'll be significantly better, uh, as we should be, as you move into the third year of your program. Uh, you expect them to be better. Um, uh, you know, I think as you as you know, the things I've talked about over the years, that first year is, uh, was difficult, just trying to get the players, the coaches, the people, the community to understand uh, your expectations and what you demand of them. I think that second year, uh, you know, it's a lot about self-awareness, self, uh, the players understanding what they can do, what they can't do. Uh, this third year as we move forward, I think the nice thing is, is the players clearly understand what we expect of them. And and I think we have some experience, uh, some guys that have been in our program, some guys that played uh, as true freshmen two years ago, some guys that played as true freshmen a year ago. I feel like we have a good blend uh, this year uh, with some upperclassmen uh, that have been in our system, our program for, for a few years, and some good young talent, I think, that you saw last year at times, I think. Uh, very critical. I think a lot has been talked about, and rightfully so, about how we started a year ago and how we finished. Um, so I think uh, that's a big part of it is building the depth that we need to compete uh, with the schedule that we have. And uh, I think that's why it's so important for us this summer uh, to have a great summer and to work extremely hard to physically uh, be able to withstand uh, an SEC schedule and Louisville at the end of the year. So. We obviously have a tough run um, as we go through the year, but our players are, are, again, that's what's so big about this phase and what we're doing this summer, uh, to get bigger, to get stronger, to be able to physically uh, be able to handle that type of a season to build the depth that we need. Have you changed anything about your summer workouts? Is anything different this year than it was the previous couple well, of years? More so than what we're changing much. We, we constantly look and evaluate and, and try to do things better. Um, you know, obviously we got off to a good start last year, so I like uh, the, the, the schedule that we did throughout the summer. Now the key is keeping that up in season. So then we got to look at uh, what we can do throughout the season to keep them uh, in great shape and to keep them able to play.